Super. Guess what he just brought? A brand new DC CDI from Ignitech. Because I have problems with my XL600. They just switches off after 5 kilometers and I don't know why. So I will mount that DC CDI from Ignitech and then I hope it will run for longer than 5 kilometers. What I think the problem with my Honda is that the ignition coil from the alternator is bad because the resistance is too high, I measured it already. And this CDI from Ignitech don't need that ignition coil, it takes 12 volt from the battery and just runs with that. So this CDI came with a connector that's connected to the CDI and pins to mount it. So what I need to do is to disconnect my original connector and mount these wires to the new CDI. I don't like that. So what I need to do is to connect these original wires with the ones from the CDI and the part came with a diagram what to connect with what so it's very easy to do. What you also have to do for this CDI is to take a key switched 12 volt from the battery and they have a description what to take so it's a black wire from back here somewhere and I did that already I connected it so this is my 12 volt for the CDI. description says that I should connect green yellow it's a sensor ground to the blue but what I have is green white I measured it it's from the sensor so that's the right one to go black red one is the one I don't need this originally came from the ignition coil but as we don't need the ignition coil anymore we also don't need the red black wire so just secure it somewhere so it's not messing around Since the CDI came with this plug and these kind of pins, I strip off the wires and will connect these yeah, pins or plugs or whatever. I don't have this special tool for this, but this player will do just fine, I hope. I will see. Any ideas?
orange goes to black yellow it's this one green goes to black white Yellow goes to blue yellow. Blue goes to green, that's ground. And black goes to 12 volt. No. So red goes to the black one I connected to the ignition key switch. And the other blue goes to the sensor ground. Double check again. Orange, black, yellow, green, black and white, yellow, Blue, yellow, ground, ground, and I double check this because there was a color mismatch. Good. Probably not the most expensive connector. Reconnect this one. Cut the zip tie. Now I need to find a good position for the actual CDI. Time to mount the tank. Will it run? I'm excited.
And by the way, don't do this in sandals. Make sure to wear proper biker shoes. Don't be a fool like me.